How about the definitive edition for Nintendo Switch? Here it is on my Switch OLED and let's discover this action-adventure game or this um, platformer here on Switch OLED. I don't know if you, if you have this game or not. Anyway, here is the description in the, in the eShop. The game uh, was made by the same uh, team that made uh, Torchlight and Torchlight 2 and it has a lot to offer this uh, this game in uh, in terms of uh, action uh, adventure puzzle games the game has almost 6 gigabytes you can play it on tv handheld mode or um, in tabletop mode with joy-con and also it has touch screen support let's go here and let's start a new game i remember playing this uh, a lot and at this moment we have uh, difficulty let's set it on easy it will be faster in order to show you the game and the sound here the music is off in my in my video anyway and let's start a new game here you have the possibility to choose either definitive mode or classic i will advise you to go with this uh, new modern uh, possibility and to discover this uh, this platformer the game it's interesting it has its strange parts and i say strange because you start with no story you don't know what happened you have to to imagine everything and you have this uh, this look that will remind you of zelda games and uh, hyrule territories but still you have these robots and so on so, so it's a very strange and uh, this mix here in the game will make the, the game even challenging so let's start in this way you will see uh, you will see the character in this way and that's why i say uh, that the land here the map will remind you of uh, zelda games anyway uh, at least uh, in my in my uh, case so uh, you don't have voice acting you don't have a story but as far as i uh, as i know in the end you will get um, the entire picture of what happened and what you are doing here anyway the graphic is beautiful and uh, the game looks astonishing here on switch oled way better than i was uh, remembering uh, remembering uh, the game from lcd model the switch lcd model so um, i will replay this uh, this first part of the game in which you will try to discover um, a place you will get an upgrade and uh, after that you will have also the possibility to attack to, and to, to, to destroy your enemies in the beginning you don't have these uh, these attacks but later you can do a lot of upgrades for your character you can even teleport you can uh, jump attack various weapons so the upgrades are here in the game and they will give you definitely the possibility to to do some interesting uh, uh, actions here the game has an open world and in the beginning it's a semi open world because you cannot access it um, from the beginning you have to do some upgrades you have to get some weapons in order to go uh, further in uh, in the on the map but overall it's a very beautiful experience and you will uh, you will find yourself here destroying enemies solving puzzles uh traveling in some world uh, in some strange environments and sometimes uh, struggling to to find the solution to a puzzle anyway uh, the game has a lot to offer and um, and my advice definitely if you like what you see here if you like this type of action adventure puzzle uh, platformer go for it anyway in my case i um, i had a lot of fun with uh, with this game for example now we have to figure how to how to follow 
uh, our friend, that huge robot. And it seems that we have to go here. So here we are. What's next? Please write a comment and share with us if you have this game, if you play it, if you know about it and anyway what is your opinion related to it, either if you have it, either if you only watch this video. By the way, please manually select the quality of this video when you, when you play it at 4K 60 frames HDR mode. And the game has even if you don't have voice, if you if you don't have text uh, to to describe what's happening, the game has some uh, powerful um, and uh, very uh, how how do I say um, the game manages to uh, to express itself very very good and uh, manages to to transmit emotions and uh, something special from this game. As you see here in these images. And to be short, to answer the questions, to get this or not, in my opinion, yes, it's a it's a very good game, and for me especially, it has a lot to offer. And yes, it's a game to put in your collection after you decide for yourself that uh, what you see here it's a game that you like never uh, never um, get a game only because me or another reviewer will say you that the game it's good because sometimes even if the game has the most beautiful graphic in the world maybe it's not the best game for you or even if the game i don't know it doesn't have the best graphic it's pixelated or something like this it might be the best game for you or for me it depends what you expect for uh, from a game everyone has its own expectations everyone um, should decide what is better and uh, what game uh, is the best for uh, for for him basically or her so in this moment we have this this upgrade we have a new arm after a huge sacrifice from our uh, from our friend and let's see how we can uh, use this i remember that we can hit and smash things but here in the beginning it's the tutorial and we have to uh, we have to learn it basically.
in this game you really have to explore everything and here we are in the beginning and this is not good so let's go back to our base Sometimes you will definitely feel lost in this in this huge world, but be patient and you will find the real uh, the real uh, uh, road or uh, path to follow. So now we can move uh, items. And this is it.
And here it is, our first weapon. And in this way we will get all kind of upgrades. Let's get back. You know, this is a very complex game and um, it has so much to offer for, uh, for everyone. As you see, the game has its uh, its own uh, mechanic and its own style to to play it, and you have to discover what to do. And once you learn 
how the game uh, works you will find your path and you will know what to do here By the way, in the game you'll find later more powerful enemies and more, uh, more uh, dangerous enemies. And because they will be huge, you will have this idea that they are super dangerous. And this is an upgrade for your arm. Once you put it here, you will receive uh, you will receive that upgrade for it. And now we can smash um, worlds, for example. So I don't know what you think about this game, anyway you can write a comment and uh, you can share that with us. In my, uh, in my perspective the game is very good and uh, it has this beautiful beautiful world that will remind us of Zelda and Hyrule territories and uh, the fact that you, you can do a lot here and you can fight with 
uh, huge enemies, a lot of enemies. Um, you have diversity, you have this open world and this incredible graphic. Uh, all these uh, will generate a very good experience in the game and at least in my uh, in my opinion the game is amazing this is uh, this is the map here and um, as i said this is an open world and you can explore it so have fun with this game and thanks for watching